looking now at the primary color red. Let's start out with this warm red. Let's also clean the palette out a little bit so I can have some clean space for my next set of mixes. We're going to need a green. I'll use lemon yellow and phthalo blue. So red plus green let me get it thicker have a stronger color there we go now when I mix some red in there down color. That gray has like a greenish brown cast to it. And of course the reason why you get brown from mixing those two colors is because yellow and blue make green. So to do the same thing here, we have our primary color over here, which is red. We have our mixed color over here, the complement of red, which is green. as we add little bits of red to that mix we're going to constantly change that color little by little we end up close to red. We can do the same thing as before and we can take our other red and before we use lemon yellow the two cool blue the cool blue and the cool yellow sorry the two cool colors. Now Let's make a green with the warm colors. So let's take this yellow, which is cadmium yellow, as you know. And let's mix it with French ultramarine blue. and we'll get that really toned down subdued green see that more earth tonish type green and if we start to mix a little bit of this powerful red at a time with it we're going to start to get some changes I'm being very careful about getting only a small amount of this one because that's that very strong staining color. If you get too much of it, it'll turn too red too fast.
we got the idea of the red and the green making gray.